Here we go. What's up, YouTube? This is Twina, and today I'm coming at you with a live deck profile, which is a first place Blue Eyes White Dragon deck profile. And I'm surprised it actually ended up topping this time because you haven't really. It's it's a, almost like a you can consider it a rogue deck, I guess. I mean, at this point, it's probably it, it's falling off the meta. Yeah, and here with I'm gonna just warn you guys. Eric. I got this last night off that guy right over there. I hope Black Wing's doing well. Um, Alright, and here we go with the deck profile. Okay, so first, uh, three of the big D. Amazing, I wish I could play five. I don't well, know what. Well, technically, you are playing like eight, six. Oh, um, yeah, or eight, probably eight, more than enough. <laughs> uh, triple of the sub, and double the one that banishes. So good. Um, once today has the tag effect actually come up. And the destruction effect, I know you can't attack, but it, it's really good. Most of the time you just sync with it or overlay. Um, triple Ancients, Triple Sage. So, with Ancients, um, what can you do with Ancients? Um, okay, so... For, your, for at least your place. End phase, turn it goes to Grave, you special... Essentially one of these... Nothing else. Don't, don't don't let anybody fool you. Just one of those. Um, then, if you had to get rid of your blue eyes with a uh, trade in, and you happen to draw into alternative, I know it's a weird kind of weird play, but essentially you can banish it, add the blue eyes back to hand. Okay. And then uh, for sage, uh, sage. I can probably get to the combos a wee bit okay. better. Yeah, we can do the uh, combos. If I after. get into uh, at the end of the video, we can, we can do combos. So okay. Um, anyway, three sage, two. I've been debating about one, but I really like it at two. I'm opening it just enough for the uh, combo. We'll probably get to that as well, which is sage and maiden. Okay. Really good combo. Um, one of him. Uh, yeah, it's kind of self-explanatory. He grabs one from Grave. Well, one level one. The uh, father of the maiden. Yeah. Um, and there's why. Originally, this was at two. I had it inside. I never tried it into a second. I really like it up one. Okay. Uh, double maxi. Worked all day. Very good for this format with all the special summoning, especially with the new deck, Zodiacs. Well, Zodiac, sorry, not Zodiac. We'll get to those later. <laughs> anyway, um, next. Triple. <laughs> Triple Melodies? Just so I can search too, why not? And uh, he's part of another combo. Um, yet again, we'll get to that. Triple Monster Reborn. <laughs> the Monster Born's banned. Since uh, 2005. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's too easy. So, Atari level one. 7 or 8 dragon seven type eight, will summon it. Dragon and Grave, and then it's got a protection effect to banish if a. Uh, if your opponent goes to Regeki or Darkhold. Yeah. Yeah. Essentially, types. it, it saves yep. it. Just uh, triple trade in. Draw power. Yeah. I really need to get these two up to uh, Ultra. ultras, but right now supers will do. Either that or... Mm, isn't trading also a secret at one point? No. No. Ultra is high Best ultra is ultra. Is ultra. Okay. Uh, double dark hole. Nice. Yeah. And uh, right now, because my twin twisters are in another deck, running two MST. Oh, they're so shiny. <laughs> <laughs> that was everyone today. I only have one of those. No, but I, I'm actually, I'm siding the third for Trap Heavy deck. Okay. Um, instant win. Every time I draw it, I've top decked it too many times today. And it's won me too many games. Um, Claude Hermos. Yeah. Um, FT Kane. FT Kane, um, late game it's a decent draw into. Most of the time you will end up with a uh, blue eyes in hand and something on field. We'll get to this bastard. <laughs> what? It just gets everything one time. Oh, come on. Okay. 
Next. Double strike, one warning, a storming on a vanities. I like, I like the vanities. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, gotta, it, it gotta go those secrets. It hurts. It hurts, guys. Oh, it hurts. <laughs> I only pulled it out once today, and it, it got MSP. Well, I mean, I could even play it. Was that the only spell you had on the field? Yeah. Only just dropping me? It was the only thing he could hit. Oh, it's wow. It's what he hit. He okay. top decked it. it. Nice. I still won. <laughs> <laughs> I won. Obviously. Oh, man. I mean, you all, you were undefeated, so. Yeah. No, but, uh, extra deck or side? Uh, go. Okay, on to the extra. Triple of Lone Fire for Synchros. It, it's... It's really good. Sadly, you can't tribute something else, but it gets really good. And you you don't always go into these guys. No. But they're really good. The protection effect is amazing. The special summon is amazing. Rex pendulums. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they can't special summon more than two at a time. Um, once per turn, I can negate graveyard. Then I can go into other stuff later. That, that's just self-explanatory. I go into this with spirit. Compulse? Yeah, it, it's it's compulse. Um, if I have two spirits, sometimes I'll go with the combo yep. with the second target for it. Okay. Um, which is... Target itself protected? Yeah. Essentially, I, I can... Depending on the board, if I open up two of these and I have a tuner in hand, I can go for the next card. Okay. Crystal Wing. Because Crystal Wing is awesome. What? Crystal Wing can be awesome. With oh, yeah. Some some of this off of almost every time I actually went into Spirit. Crystal Wing today was off of Soul Charge. Soul Charge and yeah, that's expected. Yeah. But okay. anyway, it's been really good. Um, two of these, surprisingly enough, I haven't gone into one today. I probably should have several times. Yeah, uh, it's a contact fusion, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, I, I've been debating putting it to one. But they're just so shiny. They're, they're lovable. You like that shine of the deck, don't you? Uh, in case you couldn't tell, I kind of blinged it. Ma <laughs> almost max rate of everything except for the max use. Uh, and, uh, cast your as a card. And, uh, trade in. Yeah, this card. So, um, initially when it's special summoned, I target a monster. Um, it gains a thousand. And then it also gains 500 for all monsters. Is it all, opponent's grave as well? All dragon type monsters on the field, so mm. both both fields and both graveyards. Yeah. Okay. So this can get absolutely insane. In fact, back when he was at when uh, Trevor over Six there was Maxi. actually playing it. I, yeah, no, he gamed with Maxi. I'm not kidding. I made 6k Maxi. 6k Maxi. It, no 6K joke. 6k effect failure. <laughs> yeah. Um, one of these guys never went no, into Daniels. it. Dan, not right now. But you can pretty easily go into it, you know. It, it's just an out to big okay. boards. Um, this package. Um, Utopia package, awesome. Um, essentially. <laughs> why, why no cipher? I mean. Um, wasn't oh, included. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, that's one. Two, I probably wouldn't play it actually. I don't know why. I just really like having the three to go into. Pop the um, card, battle phase, lockdown, foolish stuff, and attack twice. Um, They're all good in their own ways. I actually side a uh, combo with this card. Back when uh, Magician Girls first came out, he was sitting there with uh, all, a full board of magicians. So I just dropped that, activated a uh, claw for most, equipped Red Eyes Black Dragon Sword to it, swung, detached one, negate all their effects, reduce their attack to zero figures, and then I gamed them. Yeah, no. Okay. I, I do have to give like almost complete credit with the deck besides uh, side and a couple of the things in main I added in like uh, those were MSTs, Maxis. Yeah, those were huge today. I have to admit the MSTs came up exactly when I needed them. Almost never went into side. Um, you'll see, but I'm actually citing a combo with this. Anyway, that wraps it up for the extra deck. Fifteen cards. Okay. Now I'll be honest. I went into the side deck once, and it wasn't even the combo that I was talking about earlier. I don't know why these two just break. Um, 
But I, I don't really know these too well, which is why I cited them out, um, took them out of the main. They still work. They work off of each other. But I cited it just in case, you know? It, it's essentially, uh, isn't it Banished Back Row and uh, Banished Monster, right? Yeah. Uh, they're... So Green has the special from the graveyard. Yeah. Um, and our grave is special from the grave, manages all of his uh, back row and have him gain 200 for each. Yeah. If they it gets really him. good with the Frog Paleozoic, but yeah. Um, second effect, Valor, in case you really need to. Um, I will say, this is probably going to kill him because he hates these cards. You would know. Two Kaijus. Because everybody Just in case likes the shit comes up. Deck. Yeah. And then the one card I actually cited into. <laughs> these. This what? is this is Vanities for uh, Light and Dark. As weird as it is, maybe Mirror Match, ABC's PK Fire, um, Dark Magician, it, it hits almost everything. Um, it's just Light and Dark Vanities. Okay, nice. Um, third MST, I told you I cited it. Uh, these two for Wind Witches, I was expecting those, um, didn't come up. Not that many people would. But, you know, you can also use these for, uh, Magispectors. I know that's actually a really good rogue deck. I traded mine away. Um, it actually helped me get this deck. But, yeah. Two system down. Didn't face any machine decks today, but it's pretty good. Yeah, especially when you only have to pay a thousand dollars to remove all from field and grave oh, for, yeah. your, for your opponent. ABC right. players, they just scoop at that. Be point. warned, yep. they 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 cry. Even if they activate ABC's effect. Um, yeah. Waving bond. And this this is the last card in the side deck. Um, but it's really good. I was originally going to play three, but it just didn't come up enough. Okay. Um, sides decent, but you don't always need to go into it a lot of the time. The main deck will just work out any problems. But yeah, these are, uh, it's a side. Isn't that the entire deck profile, right? Okay, so now we're going to go through the combos a little bit. It's going to be a little quicker. I'm not going to explain it to complete depth about it, but he's going to show you a couple of the combos that you can do with the deck as soon as he's ready. Side, yeah. He crossed over to the dark side, though. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to try to go through these combos as fast as possible. You open up any of these... Oh, sorry. <laughs> you probably can't see that. Uh, you open up any of these two-card combos. Well, not this one. This one needs to go with that card. Okay, so you open up these. You've got a really good setup, especially if you open up with any of the traps. Um, okay, so this combo right here. Um, essentially, you activate this, you pitch this, and you grab a... Alternative and blue eyes. Um, you then get the alternative pop a card. Um, this is one of the lesser combos, I will admit. But if you do have another tuner in hand, you can go into the synchro, which is essentially it. Okay. And end phase special summon one from deck. So you've got two 3k beaters and you pop the card. Um, next combo was. Um, Opening up these two. Essentially, normal summon, grab this, do what you did with these, but you now have the tumor for the synchro play. Which, you almost always put this in defense, remember that. Um, okay. Um, these two. So this is actually a really easy combo for gaming your opponent. Okay? Normal summon, effect in hand, target and send to grave, effect when it's targeted. Then you special summon uh, two blue eyes from deck, and then you contact fuse into this, swing, and uh, yeah, it's game. Anyway, uh, those are all the simple combos. Other than that, it gets very specific. Um, but yeah, they worked out. Got me first. All right. Well, we'll probably get some more 
different combos and maybe even some more deck profiles later on. So this has been Suena and Eric signing off. Peace.